Embrace the pain like I'm Nagato Got no father like I'm Naruto Keep the blade on me, Ichigo Who really wanna go toe for toe? DTR from Tokyo Diamonds whipping up on the stove Lucky man like a four-leaf glow Diamonds wanna go Hello guys, my name is Nagato And for today's tutorial, basically I'm gonna be showing you guys On how to install Re or RetroArch Pico Drive the emulator onto your PS4. First thing you need to do is go ahead into the internet browser. Go ahead and run this website. Basically for this tutorial, go ahead and run X Project. And then you want to hit L1 on your controller once the site boots up to run the uh, HEN 1.8 payload so we can install debug settings and also run unsigned code. So from there, once you do that, go ahead into your settings all the way down to debug settings go to game package installer and then whatever you named your package installer in this case I've already installed it so I'm going to st skip this step but all you would have to do is go ahead and install the uh, pico drive package if you named the pico drive but once you installed it it should pop up back in your main menu but in this case I already had it installed so you just go ahead and click update later if you get that message error go ahead and wait for the game to boot up it may uh, give you like a video recording playback area error, which is okay. Also, uh, these games still work with video recording too on your PlayStation 4. Um, you can still record like just any other regular game, but that's besides the point for this tutorial. Um, but the first thing you want to go to is go ahead and go to low content. Um, basically, you have to click circle, circle the X, kind of like how if you would, um, you know, if you ever play Japanese games from PlayStation circles really X so just go ahead and hit circle go to the this option right here CDFS scroll through here wherever you dumped your games into either the master system if you have master system games and you did all the process correct in the first tutorial I had then it should be there but in my case I only have Mega Drive or basically Sega Genesis games go ahead and click that and then whatever game you want to uh, try out so in this case let's try out uh, Streets of Rage and then go ahead and click circle to select it through it may take one or two seconds and you may get this white line at the bottom it does go away but yeah that's essentially on how to play Sega games on your um, PlayStation 4 so I'll just show you guys and this is running in real time so yep that is me I'll go back out to the main menu real quick so you can tell this is not uh, you know trickery or anything editing this is a uh, PlayStation 4 yeah, I'll click on that real quick but yep that's how you play you know so I get Genesis games on your PlayStation 4 and it looks pretty amazing you know with 1080p um, I'm using a PlayStation 4 Pro so I can even put this out to like to you know 2160p 4k resolution so that you know will look awesome on these classic games but with that being said um thanks for watching my name is nagato and i'm signing out thank you